What's my favorite thing about being married? I think it's uh, it's just that feeling of family, you know, um, having your person and and finally feeling like you've started your own family. I, I always wanted to get married, um, and I had no idea it would be to Bob. <laughs> it was just really cool because we've been friends for so long and not, and been in each other's lives for so long before we got married. So there was a trust, or we already laid that foundation of trust and the feeling like we're in a safe space. Yeah. If we could live uh, one single moment in our lives forever, what would it be? When we were standing on top of that mountain uh, in Hawaii. The, when we said our vows and got married um, in Hawaii, it was absolutely magical. And mm -hmm. we said I do to each other. It was a very special moment. And it's something that I like to recall almost daily and think about because it's a beautiful thing. That safety and feeling of belonging, it's the best. We got married was uh, magical. It's like something I've never felt before. So, it came out of the hundred. Uh, there's a lot of free food. Um, um, what else? I got to keep some clothes. Um, oh, you silly! And all I was thinking about was you and me and how wonderful the world was. So. I was just trying to make my own wife laugh. <laughs> <laughs> it's best to so make sure that you're She's gotten like she's been such an amazing support. You know, he's been such a a big um help to me. Mm. He supports me. Yeah, absolutely. I just look at my wife and think that she's just this superhero for doing it. We also ended up falling in love and getting married. When he asked me out, I was like, you know what, you're my best friend and we laugh a lot together. It felt so natural. The best decision I've ever made. Very happy. Yeah. Why don't you dance up to me? I do. No, I can't dance up to you and then walk off. I'm Bob and then just... <laughs> I, would, I want it. Okay, we're going to do it now. Oh, bye. Like, have you guys become closer now that you guys are calling? <laughs> Sorry, have I was, you always I was, been... I was, that was a reaction to how hot I'm feeling right now. I was like, wow, I'm hot. No, like, Not oh, because man, of the question. question, because of the temperature. Like, I was my best friend and being able to share and be honest with her and talk about everything, also have, like, a partner in crime and someone to laugh with things about and also... Yeah, it's, you know, I think if it's just, it's such a wonderful thing to be in that union with each other and to have that commitment to each other, to somebody that you love. I think that's the best thing about marriage. Well, I'm in love with her. I'm just getting to know the cast who I would, you know, some of them I would marry. Just one of them, that one. Marrying Eliza in the end, you know, getting to know her. And yeah. Falling in love in that way it has been the best thing about the show for me. We'll tell our stories on these walls. Me, it was adopting Bowie. He hasn't changed his last name, he's still Bowie Taylor. He'll come Instagram. around. He'll come so, around. What? I'm not your real dad. Oh, he's just, he's going through that. We'll tell our stories on Bob, who became my husband. <laughs> he was my best friend throughout the show. And I got to walk away with it, you know, with getting married and, you know, marrying my best friend, which is pretty awesome. If you were trapped on a desert island, which character and which actor from the show would you want to It's easy. Uh, my wife is the Give us bread, give us all. I like the new group. Yeah, I hate the new You have these keyboard warriors who who feel like they are like judge, jury, and prosecutor. The people taking speculation as fact. And one thing I've learned through that and through like this really kind of rocky road on social media is, and the thing that I would say to my younger self is, it's none of your business what other people think of you. 
Like it's just not. <laughs> it's their business, and as long as you're a good person and you live with compassion and love, you can't look. And also, like, I was terrified of actually hurting you. You make a commitment, a lot of people are like, oh, you lose a piece of yourself, or like, you know, you blend into that person. And I just don't believe that that's true. I, I love your engagement ring, it's very pretty. And one thing that, that I found in my marriage is that I have, I'm no longer chasing that piece of myself, I have my whole self. I am my whole self. The chemistry that Eliza and I have working, I've never really had with anyone else. It's just such an easy, comfortable thing. And I think we as humans have great chemistry. We have that, that love for each other. You're also married to probably one of the nicest guys in the world, and he's just so kind. Thank you, I know, I know. I'm really, really happy we both are, so. Yeah. Me and Bob are very good at cuddling. It's Eliza, more... Eliza, will you marry me? Marry me now. And I just realised that whatever capacity it was, I wanted Eliza to be in my life. I'm just so grateful that I have my confidant and my partner in life. Is this how you imagined it to be, you and I being together? Um, what title would you give this, this chapter of your life and why? Um, I'd say it's the honeymoon. It's just been, for Bob and I, it's been like an extended honeymoon. Um, do Bob and I have a special couple song? We do it's called bad days by david ramirez and it's just you know it kind of it reminds us of of, of us in the good times and bad and yeah it's just beautiful it makes me think of my honey yeah and you call me little oh yeah, yeah. hi little yeah. 2020 has been pretty pretty wacky so you know i'm i'm just happy to spend it with her at home but one thing that I'm really grateful for is the amount of time that I've been able to spend, you know, with Eliza. Um, why is Bobby comfortable around you and not other men? I don't know. Yeah. Bobby's just always been comfortable around you. But, I mean, he just must have known you were the one. <laughs> I love you not only for what you are, but for what I am when I am with you. You'll never age, nor fade, nor die for me. That I just went, okay, this is this is it. It just it just made so much sense. I feel like <laughs> uh, Panda was a surprise to me because Bob told me that we were getting her just before we got married. What about you? Well, it's a place we both live. <laughs>